Hello, this is Chiron Intuition, and I'm here to do a reading for the collective. It's not going to resonate with everyone, but if it does, take what goes, and please, leave what does not. We have guides, we have protection, we have spiritual cleansing. So maybe somebody's guided to do a, clean, a protection, a cleansing of protection or some type of protection work. It says friendship and then it says shift. Hmm. So maybe somebody's not a friend anymore. What is this energy here? What's underneath shift? It says stormy. Yeah, it's something different here now. Like somebody has shifted. Their energy has shifted on you. They're not the same towards you. You have to protect yourself against this person. Like they change. There's something different about them. Like it's almost like they've chosen to just be negative or they just they have just chosen to be your karmic. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody that was in your energy because it says friendship and then it says shift. So it was somebody that was in your energy that has chosen to be a karmic in your life. Something they don't like about you. They will never like about you. They just don't fucking like you. That's it. And that's their problem. I'm about to say that's their fucking problem. But that's their problem. That's not your problem. Now, you do have to protect yourself, though. That's what somebody's being guided to do. Look, we got the star. So they don't like the star. Oh, fucking well. You know? What's this at the bottom? Yeah, Ten of Pentacles. <laughs> like, oh, well. You don't like the star? Oh, well. The star is still going to shine. The star still has a job to do here. Let me get something here. But most importantly, you need to protect yourself. The star is also about cleansing, too. Let me get something here. Aquarius energy. Something about you helping others. You're probably healing others too. Look, four of sword, bring in peace. Okay, bring in peace. Mental stability here. Let me get something here with this. Nah, this is an energy. This star right here is not worried about nothing. Okay, they're in a state of peace, in a state of rest. And you got somebody that's chosen, they, they just want to be your karmic. Oh, well, we have the Hierophant energy here. Something here you were chosen to do, or you're going to be around others or a part of something that has rules and laws. And, you know, it's something here you're going to be a part of. I don't know what type of institution or it's a job or it's something here where maybe there's others like you or others will come to you. But it's a very important title in society. I don't know what it is, but it's very important and you're different and somebody has just chosen to be your karmic because of what you're chosen to do, what you have been chosen to do, maybe what you worked for, because the star just doesn't just get there. The star has worked their energy up to that frequency over many lifetimes. OK, we have the ace of Pentacles, we have the three of Pentacles, and then we have the eight of sword. Nah, man, this is just terrible. It's like somebody, I feel like you're getting something here that you earned or something that was, you know, let's say God given. It was an opportunity. Maybe you're taking advantage of it, right? They want that to be blocked. It's funny how these, the eight of sword comes out like that. But let me get something here with this Howard font. That's why you got to protect yourself from this person. You got to protect yourself. We have the Queen of Wands energy here, fire sign energy, also Taurus Sagittarius. Let me get something here with this. And we have the Seven of Swords. So the Queen of Wands is playing games. The Queen of Wands is playing games. Let me get something here with this. We have the Five of Pentacles here. Wait a minute. Let me get something with this. One more. 
Yeah, they're trying to do something to somebody's money, resources or something. We have temperance energy. Sagittarius again. So it's something about hurting somebody that's pure or purified or you're on your healing path. You're on a path of balance or trying to balance or stay balanced or clean or something here like that. Okay, that's the energy that I'm seeing. And we have the Queen of Cups energy. So it's like it's giving a Queen of Wands like somebody that wants to control somebody that wants to force their will on somebody else or force their energy on somebody else. That's what you're dealing with. And yes, you do have to protect yourself because you may not even notice the things that happen. You may not even notice, you know, but it's like people actually use their energy to hurt other people. For no reason, because they're jealous, because it's something within their shadow that they don't have the energy to take care of that. But they got the energy to send some shit out because they're hurt. OK, because that's what I'm getting. Because it says friendship and then shift. Like, <laughs> you know, weird how your friends become like your worst enemies and shit. What's this energy here with this? Okay, and we got three major arcana. So we have the star, we have the hierophant, we have temperance energy. Those are very high energies, very spiritual energies. We got a celestial being. We got a basically a person chosen to do what they're doing on Earth. Okay, under, you know, your profession is, if you're chosen for your profession, your profession is only like a jacket that you put on or only a coat. I don't even know how to explain it. When you're chosen for what you're meant to do, you see higher than it. You see that this is what you were meant to do. This is how you help people. This is how you're there. That's why they have institutions and places for people like this energy to go. Or how can I say it's so deep? Let me get something here with this. Oh, yeah. And then you got temperance. That's what I was saying. You have like very important figures in the tarot and then temperance is a very high level the level of balance and patience and purity that's hard to really be okay in real life not just at church or just when people are looking at you but that's really hard to be in real life let me get something here We have the King of Wands here. Okay, Eight of Pentacles, King of Wands is somebody that's very good at what they do. They're very skilled. It shows in their energy. They're a natural leader at something. Okay, they're a pusher. They make shit happen. Let me get something here with this Hierophant. We have the Six of Swords energy. Maybe it's something that you're meant to do that's moving something forward. It's moving something about maybe knowledge or information. It's moving something forward. It's maybe changing something. What's here with this Queen of Wands? What's going on with this Queen of Wands? We have the Seven of Swords again. See, I don't trust this Queen. I don't. It's not all Queen of Wands, right? It's just the one that's here. This Queen of Wands, I don't trust that one. It's a feminine fire energy. Okay? Male or female. I do not trust that energy in this reading. Because I feel like they're trying to sabotage something. They're trying to hurt something. Okay? Because of your title. Or what you have. Or who you are. And it's like they're jealous. Okay? They're just jealous. That's really what it is. The Queen of Wands in this reading is jealous. And that's why they're trying to interfere that's why they're in this high level of deception. It's two seven of sword touching the queen of wands. OK, I'm just being real. You cannot trust them. I don't know if they used to be your friend. They used to be somebody that was in your corner. They used to used to used to. OK, it's not like that no more. It'll never be like that again. 
straight up hater. What's here with this seven of sword energy? What's here with this? And then we have the Knight of Cups. This is full of fucking poison. You can't trust that. It's underneath the seven of sword. Get the hell up out of here with that. I just saw somebody offer somebody a drink. No, I don't fucking drink. I don't drink. I don't want no drink. Okay? Or I don't like that. What's that? Oh, no, I don't drink that. <laughs> like, I don't give a fuck. Don't drink it. Don't drink it. We have the Ace of Pentacles here. Mm-mm. Mm -mm. They have nothing to give you from the Five of Pentacles. They have nothing to give you from the Five of Pentacles. They're lying. They have nothing to give you. I'm talking about some blessing. And we have the Knight of Wands energy. So look, the Knight of Cups and the Knight of Wands are actually looking at each other. They're both looking at each other. Water sign, fire sign, energy. It's something here about the Ace of Pentacles. Something dear. Something maybe beloved. Something like money like oh they're talking about this oh we can make money off of this we could get this because we in the five of pentacles so we could do this this that and the third now nah, you can't trust these people you can't trust these fucking people say judgment okay the trumpet is sounding on that ass no 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 you can't trust them that's like moving somebody in the house knowing your ass is getting evicted you gotta now you done you got a roommate and your ass is getting evicted the roommate don't know your ass is getting evicted and by the time they find out their ass is locked out and you get what I'm saying? It's something here. No, y'all in the five of pentacles. You can't offer me nothing. Okay. No. What's this here with this, um, this eight of pentacles. What's here with this? Oh, you see how that shit flew over there? Lord, we got the nine of pentacles here. The eight and the nine. So somebody's very hardworking and they're blessed. Okay. The fruits of the labor. Okay. The results is showing from the eight of pentacles. Yeah, this shit is glowing. Something is glowing here. Something is glowing. You need to protect yourself. Protect your energy. Protect your glow. We have the Ace of Wands energy here. Yeah. This, who, huh. Let me get something here with this. What is this energy here? What is this energy? What is this energy? Yes, Eight of Wands. Somebody's very driven. Very powerful. Very powerful. Standing in their power. Okay taking action here doing what they got to do focusing getting it done what's here with this what's here with this we have the two of wands energy here hmm it's also some type of doorway but i don't like that the seven of sword is above that and then the queen of wands so what is this what is this somebody planning to do some shit what is this Wow, we have a lot of wands down here. Ten of wands here. Wow, ten of wands. You can't trust that damn. You can't trust nothing that some. They're not a friend. I am so sorry. I don't know who this is. They're not a friend. You can't trust it. I am so sorry. What is here with this Ace of Pentacles? What's here with this? We have the Two of Wands again. It's like they're really trying to get something. They're really trying to cross the line here. That's what they're really doing. What is this energy here? All this is fire. And now we got the two of cups. Nah. Nah. This is just too much. It's too much. To get some type of money, to get some type of resources from somebody. This is way too much. And it leads to the two of cups? Nah. Let me get something here with this. We got the lover's card. Mm-mm. Gemini energy. What's this here? They want to be partnered with you. I don't think so. Because they're not with they're not for you. We have the nine of pentacles again. That's why they want to be partnered with you. So there's a shift in the energy here. Somebody's not cool with you. You need to stay clear of this person. You don't need to get any type of business deals. You don't need to get into any type of contracts. You don't need to get into any fucking thing because they're going to shift on you. They're going to change on you. They're going to try to control you. Okay? They don't understand what the star is. They think that they control every fucking thing. They don't understand that the star got their own path. They're going to try to control you. They're going to get you in this wonky donkey ass contract or some shit. 
or something stupid, something here to get some type of money. I swear on everything. They're going to try to do something here and it's only going to damage you. You have to protect your energy. You have to stay cleansed of this person and their energy. That's the truth. Let me get something here because they just want something from you. They want a piece of your fruits. OK, they want a piece. They don't want a piece of the labor, but they want a piece of the fruit. Let me get something out here. We have the chariot energy here. Uh-huh. Cancer energy. Let me get something here with this. You know, the chariot succeeds. The chariot moves forward. We have judgment. Okay. I know we've seen judgment before. But we got judgment here. What is this energy? We have the six of pentacles. No, the kind of relationship you're going to get is going to be equal. It's going to be fair. It's going to be for you. Okay, that's where you're going. You're going where there's another nine of pentacles, not where the five of pentacles is. You're going where there's another nine of pentacles and that nine of pentacles is going to turn into the ten of pentacles. Remember, we had the star and the ten of pentacles at the beginning. Yeah, you're going to go to another relationship that they have the nine of pentacles here. It's not so much about the money, but it is about the work. It is about the work. And what you put into it and what you build people be working fucking hard okay a lot of people don't see it let me get something here with this we have the six of wands energy here okay the six of pentacles and the six of wands oh yeah somebody's definitely going to succeed somebody's definitely going to get what they're worth they're going to get what they earn they're going to get every fucking piece of it look another six of wands the six of wands came out here twice the six of wands came out here twice. You're definitely going to get this relationship. This is for you. This is for you. It's not for them. It's not for them. It's for you. But they're looking at it. I'm not even going to pick those up. They're looking at it, but it's not for both of y'all. It's for you because you worked for it. Okay. What's this here at the bottom? And we got the eight of cups. So somebody not playing. They walking away from this shit. As soon as you catch on to this shit, because I'm telling you, if you don't protect yourself from this person, this person will have access to you in the wrong kind of ways. OK, and they're going to try to fuck you up. They're going to try to damage you. They're going to try to do something here. They're very strategic here. Calculated. I don't know what how they're going to do it. If it's pictures, if it's like getting some type of information, making some information. I don't know what the fuck they're going to do. But it's something here you can't trust this person because this person, their whole goal is to control you. So they're going to try to get some information or something here that they can try to control you. <laughs> nah. Let me get something here. What is the energy? Okay. The first card I see is death. And that's on. A, that's what a stack of cards. Now we got the queen of wands. Did you hear what I just fucking said? I'm not playing. The first card that was flipped out, it was just like this. That's the death card right here. It says the graveyard. That's the death card. Okay. And I flipped this over and it was the queen of wands. And who did I say I didn't trust in this reading? The queen of wands. And it's the death card there. Now I got to look at the rest of these. Now I got to look at the rest of these cards that's underneath the death card. So we got the death card here. We got the four of roots. Yeah, that could be somebody for real underneath the ground. It's something here about, well, I, that's maybe not for everybody, but on to the next part. There's something here about them owning something or holding on to something or like that's going to be over. Some type of contract is going to be over. Whatever it is that they thought they was holding on to is going to be over. Also, Scorpio energy. Yeah, guess what else is here? The seven of damn sword. The seven of sword is out here three times. The queen of wands is out here three times. Ain't the queen of wands out here three times? I know I've seen her once and then I've seen another seven of sword. No, okay. I think the queen of wands is out here twice then. Okay, yeah, I think the queen of wands, out. that shit, that's enough. That's enough. We got the queen of wands out here twice. But the seven of sword is definitely out here three times. Okay. Wait, where did it go? Oh, there it is. Yeah. Now we got, what is this, the page? No, this is the knight of cups. No, this is the page of cups. I'm tripping. So we got the page of cups here. No, you can't trust that. Then we got the five of cups. Somebody wants you to feel sorry for them. We got the emperor and then we got the sun. But what's written on these cards is protection and blessing. 
Hmm. It's something here about protecting your blessings for real. It's something here that's within. It's shining. It's going to shine. You're going to be leading something, ruling something, the head of something. You're going to have power of something. You are. That's a very strong energy to come out together. The emperor and the sun. And on the card, it says protection and blessing. Mm hmm. Yeah, you're going to be all right. What's this here with this? We have transformation. That's the Scorpio energy again. And it says opportunity and change. So don't, I don't know. It's giving me, don't go back. It's giving me, you have the opportunity right now Chiron, to change whatever it is you need to change. And I really think it's this friend or whoever the, the hell this is that's in your energy that you need to cleanse your energy of. You need to protect yourself from this person because this person will try to take advantage of you. Okay, they're going to switch that shit all up. But I'm going to leave it right here. If you like the way that I read, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so much for your likes, shares, and subscribes. I truly appreciate it because it is how we get the messages out in order to elevate the collective. I love you guys, and I'll be back with another reading later. Bye.